Hello, my name is uh, Magdalena and I was a resident at the VIA uh, from October to uh, November 2020. Actually, it was my third time in Leipzig. Uh, first time was about 10 years ago. And at that moment, I've seen a Museum of Modern Art in Leipzig. Uh, the second time was when I had visited uh, Cyril during his residency. I couldn't even imagine that I would be there as a resident too. I'm surprised how much support artists can get from the city. It's great that uh, Leipzig can appreciate uh, artists and understand them. Hello, my name is Cyril Polacek. I'm an artist from Krakow. I was already twice in uh, Leipzig. First time was in uh, 2018. I was here with uh, my friends from Krakow, uh, Karolina Jabojska and uh, Tomasz Kręcicki. We have kind of gallery called Potencia in, in Krakow. It's uh, it's an uh, art trans space, art collective. We do many different things. And we were in 2018 in uh, Leipzig. It was in summer very hot months, so we were splitting time for painting, of course, in studio and going to lakes. In 2020, I'm again here in Lia now with Martina and our son Miron. It's challenging to be with toddler in studio because it won't, he wants to eat um, some oil paints and other uh, art supplies, so we have to keep floor clean all the time. But we're still productive and we, we're sharing time for caring of him and making art and it works fine. The most stimulating for me was uh, walks with my son. Both of us, me and my partner, uh, spent many hours walking. The main reason for that was to let the other person work. I would split uh, our time with uh, our little uh, child. I've seen so many great places, pubs, uh, canal. Uh, the first month was without even lockdown, so we could go to places like museum. And walking was also important for me because it is the best time for uh, the best opportunity to think and spend some time with times with new idea. Spinera itself, all these post-industrial surroundings, this is place of work of many painters I always admired, especially when I was student of academy and I still like them. The studio was very stimulating too because it's really big and bright with big windows. So uh, yeah, uh, light is very strong inside and this is important for painters to have good light. I think that a similar historical background is very important for both cities. Uh, it is great that cities want to cultivate the, their cooperation. And there are many artists who are interested in historical treats in their work. What is interesting for me is the period uh, of the 90s and the changes that took place in Poland then. I think that this period, that period uh, was also really important for Leipzig. Having this partnership between Krakow and Leipzig is a great thing. I think, I hope it will uh, get closer. 
from my perspective, looks like Krakow should do a little, a little bit more because uh, as a Krakow artist, I was in Leipzig for residency already twice, and in Krakow we had two painters from Leipzig in 2018. It was Maria Schumacher and Sebastian Gogel. They made really nice exhibition after they stay, but it was just one month. And Sebastian even had exhibition in our small gallery Potencia. Really nice exhibition. But that's it. Uh, since then, nothing happened here. Still, we don't have any permanent art residency program uh, in uh, visual art in Krakow. It looks like it's time to do it, to establish some, maybe museums or one of art institutions in Krakow should do it, or city should support some private new residency, I don't know, but it's, it's, it's time to do something, because Krakow is a big city and having notes Residency sucks. It's really important and stimulating for the local art community to have somebody from other countries, some 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 foreigner artist. It's it's good for both sides. My favorite experience was visit in Ekaterina Gagishian studio. Um, she was an artist from other residency in Spinnerei. And I think it was at the end of our uh, staying on the residency. And it was really stimulating for me. It's so wonderful that assistant of Leah can arrange for the resident visits like that. I'm really grateful. Uh, it was really great to see how she work and how he, how she can uh, manage her time during residency period. And I think for artists it's really important to um, observe how different artists work and. Uh, especially when the topic is maybe a bit similar to um, both artists. So I was really happy that I can I had a chance to see how she works. It's not easy to choose. I think just uh, daily life with family and residence from Leah working, spending time together in nice surroundings. The canal uh, in Leipzig, because you can feel almost like in suburban, in the middle of the city. And I think also really close to the Spinnerei, there is a really nice um, market and is uh, inside a large space so you can go there and don't even freeze during the winter time so I think both of this thing was really surprising for me nature of course lakes canals parks strange uh, spots like a playground made of wood that look that looked not very safe, but very cool. I think kids must love it. Strange anarchistic camps, for example, that looked like, uh, like taken from post-apocalyptic films. And also many galleries, artist trans spaces, uh, a lot of them in the Lindenau district, close to Spinnerei, 